What is the future for Eddie Howe at Newcastle? Lot of talk about is he the right man to continue this journey with Newcastle? Personally, myself, I, I think. Yeah, I'm not seeing that they need to make a change anytime soon because you have to bring in the factors of what's gone wrong this season and injuries have been a massive issue yeah. for them. But where do you stand on Eddie Howe? Absolutely, give him the backing. Go into the summer, give him what you can to make Newcastle a better team. He, he, he'll see a lot between now and the end of the season of what he needs to do and the most important things. He'll have a numbers list of priorities what he needs to do at Newcastle. Some might be getting players out. Some will be getting players in that fit certain positions, looking at the medical staff. Um, always managers have way more than they used to do that. They are looking at everything in football that improves their club. Um, and it's been difficult. I mean, it doesn't help when you get Man City in the draw away, does no, it? You know, you're not. always up against it. I just think the difficult thing for Newcastle fans yesterday, uh, I think they will really want to have a go. And I think it was Newcastle could never get in that position in the game where they just mm. wanted to test City, make it hard for them. Even if you lose the game, make sure they've come out of that game thinking, oh, it could have gone either way there. And, and they never got in that position in Newcastle. And um, obviously, last season was just so fantastic for them to finish in the top four yeah. to earn that Champions League spot for this season, which obviously didn't go to plan, but they've, they had some incredible games in that with that PSG victory, for example. Um is that sort of also a sign of they over overachieved so much that the expectations were were put upon them this season mm. maybe that were too much the expectations? Well, I, I'm I'm always been really big on loyalty in that, <clears throat> and sometimes you have to stand by players, and and you know and back them that your judgment's right. Um, how far do you take that? Well, obviously that is a difficult line because sometimes you just have to move people on. You know that's what Liverpool did with. Jordan Dennison, Milner, they get to a certain stage, you know, age, um, and then move on. They have to, even though they love them as players and still think they could do a job, they still move them on. And I think Newcastle might have to do similar things. I really like Callum Wilson. I think he's good. I think he's a really good player and I think he's always reliable, get goals. I know he's been injured. He's been in, injured a lot. But I probably would move on from Callum Wilson in the summer. Mm. I know he did nothing to do with Jesse because he wasn't involved. But I'm just talking in as a squad how you have to sometimes make decisions that... And, and Eddie might go, well, how do I replace Callum? Because I might even get a striker in that won't get t the 10 goals that Callum could get me mm, plus mm. in a season. So you, you've you got really difficult choices to make. Um, but I do believe that he is the right man. He's earned the right. You think of the players that come in. People like Botman have come in. Mm -hmm. have done really well. He, he got Shah to sign a new contract. Trippi had joined the club. Pope had joined the club. You know, so there's a lot of good things. Liver Menso, there's lots of good things that have happened at Newcastle. Um, so for me, it's back him again and then make an assessment next year of how you do. It's a season by season thing with managers and that. But I, I think we're ma missing so much loyalty within the game. Mm. And you can't just keep sacking every time you, you have a bad run or things don't work out. You have to look at it realistically and go, well, we still believe he's the right guy. And if if not, then you move on. But I suppose that's where it comes down to what you see as an owner, like the, the good work you see, yeah. in, in the sense of if you know the manager's got a good relationship with his players, yeah. but there are mitigating circumstances like injuries that have been so costly for you, 